What's up, man? 25 Gamers. In today's video, we'll be taking a look at our base blitz beating formation out of the shotgun doubles formation in the Dallas Cowboys playbook. Um, actually, I was thinking about it. I was going back and forth. Let's take a look at this. This is a new formation. You don't see it a lot. Normal Y flex tight. And I wanted to. I did want to break that down. Doubles is the same that we've been doing all year, and you could certainly use that. But the first play, we're going to look at a slot cross. Um, second play is halfback slip screen. Third play is quick base. And then the fourth play I wanted to show you guys was the smash corners or curl flats, either or. But we'll use smash corners. Okay. So what we're going to do is, and this is a situation where they're going to be blitzing, so we're going to show you this out of the nickel normal package. Um, let, me get to the, let me get to the flex tight. I like this because it's a, it's just a really, it's a really balanced formation, and it's new, and it's, it's pretty cool to break this down. So let's just, I'm excited about this. Let's get into this. So basic zone blitz. What we're going to have at the snap of the ball is I want to do on this play is I'm going to put Eric Decker here on a smoke screen. And if they're in a zone blitz, it's going to be wide open every time. And we're just going to take that quick four yards against the blitz. Every time, automatic, just easy read. Second read, if that's covered, that's going to mean they're in a basic coverage. And if they are in a basic coverage, that's going to mean that you can hit, excuse me, excuse me. If that's covered, that's going to mean they may be in a, in a man blitz. And if that's covered, you're going to go to your second read, which is Demarius Thomas. Cutting across, pass lead to the left, and he's going to beat man coverage. Okay. Third read. It's going to be your running back out of the backfield. Against the generic coverage, he's going to be wide open. So just as he releases to the out to the flat, and that smoke screen is going to serve almost like a blocker for him. So this works really good in combination with all these routes. Against the zone blitz, he's not always open just because of the way the zones play. As you see there, the zone blitz kind of stopped him. But again, just quick release to the back. Easy to do. Third read uh, is going to be the two men under. If they are in two men under, Welker should be open as well. Thomas is going to be open, and I'm pretty sure Welker breaks open. Pass lead him down, and you see he's going to get open against two man under. And then our last read is Demarius Thomas's deep route. This is from max coverage defenses, something like this, and you're just going to see he's going to get bumped, of course. But he's going to cut to that inside and get crazy separation against man and then have a chance at, at breaking one off after catch. So that's how we use that play. Next play we're going to look at is the slip is the slip screen pretty simple. We like to put the running back on a blue and release pattern. We like to slide protect to the right. And then I like to put Thomas here. I like to put him on a drag. And I like to put Eric Decker on a smart routed out route. First read is going to be Thomas coming across. If that's open, that's open. If it's not, it's not. Just kind of read it. Um, second read is going to be the wheel route to Welker. It's going to be man coverage. And it's also going to be zone blisses. And you see, just get the ball to your hands quick. All right. And then if those two things aren't open, then you're going to look to your screen pass. there you see you get the screen pass out of the backfield you could just leave him on his standard slip screen if you want it doesn't change the it doesn't change the reads or the progression he's just gonna it's gonna be a little more frequent in your timing but it's also going to be easier for the defense to pick up on third read uh, or excuse me fourth read is the out route to Eric Decker it's gonna be um, a lot of coverages it's only not only thing it doesn't beat is cover four and cover two sink and then the last play, or the last read on this play is for max coverage situation. So if they just drop everybody back and they put a contain out there for your screen, then you're going to have Demarius Thomas here. Remember to smart route him before you call hike and pass lead him down into the inside and he gets in a tender spot on the field that is very difficult to cover. So that's how we use the slip screen. The last play is the um, quick base real quick we'll go over the quick base just snap go it's just an inside run that's how it works just like an inside zone run with a pulling guard I mean that's all it is if the best reads to go out go out but typically the best read is going to be to go follow your guard up the hole there so so we like to do there 
And then the last play is smash corners. What we like to do on um, this is one side we're going to run curl flats. The other side we're going to run smash corners. So, for example, here we'll run a, we would run curl flats to the right. So, Thomas will put him on a flat. Decker will put on a smart routed out route. And Demarius Thomas on the left will put him on the smoke screen. First read on this play is the smoke screen. A lot of times it's going to be open. Let's send again, again zone blitzes. It's going to be open. Okay. Next read on this play is going to be the um, the uh, flat to the to the right now. So left flat's not open. We'll look to the right flat against cover four or something like that. It might be open. And then your third read is going to be your um, your running back, or excuse me, not your running back, your um, route against man or cover three. That's going to be wide open. Your um, next read is going to be against. Let me see if I can find via. Yeah, is uh your your fourth read is going to be your corner route. It's going to be open against cover two sink. Pass lead it to the left and up. Wow. I don't know what happened on that. That was weird. Let me show it to you again. Might have just been a fluke thing. So there's our play. Get to the play here. All right. And there you see it. Eh, I mean, it kind of does get open. I don't know. I guess most cover two sinks it'll be it'll be open though. I don't know why it's not. It might be just because it's a sugar D. Let's put a, just a regular two man under. Something like this. That's a standard, typical cover two sink. I don't know why it wasn't working right for the first one, but you see here, it's going to get open. The running back, but typically you'll be able to hit the running back out of the backfield against cover two sink. So we'll show you that real quick. Wide open on the backfield, you see you just hit him. Once you see the out covered, you can see your running back's going to be wide open. Your running back will actually be open against um, a lot of sta a lot of uh, coverages pretty much every coverage actually pass lead him up it, you, you just pass lead him differently based on the look so that's how we use the blitz beater guys it beats both blitzes it's just a really good formation also to use i'd say it's almost like an x-factor formation in and of itself uh, we use it very sparingly but we can do a lot of different things from it and uh, love 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 this formation guys if you have any questions or need further explanation let me know in the comments below if you have anything you need to give me feedback wise comments are there for you or you can email me my email is in the description thanks for watching today guys i really appreciate another great opportunity to share with you and if you could do me a favor and share this video on twitter i greatly appreciate it thanks and we'll see you guys later